Hey, welcome to Mainland Cycle Center's pre-owned vehicle department. This is a 2007 Kawasaki Brute Force 750. This is a 2008 model Brute Force 750. This one's got a few extras on it. It's got some uh, LED lights on them. I've got those turned on for you. Uh, it's got a stereo with four speakers. It's got a lift kit. Uh, got a passenger backrest or a driver backrest on the rear rack. It's got a set of uh, custom alloy wheels with 27 inch swamp light tires. Uh, it's pretty low hours on this. We're going to take a look. I believe it's got 128 hours on it. These are fully independent suspension front and rear. This one does have the lift kit on it. You can see the lift right here is this little bracket that was added here is the lift the plastics all in pretty good shape it's got scuffs and marks from use we've got it shined up of course but uh, uh, it does have marks and scuffs and things on it from use uh, your speaker box looks like this has been coated in some line X or something uh, but it's got four uh, fusion speakers, a little weatherproof radio cover with a JVC stereo. Let's see if we can get in there a little closer on the stereo. You got a CD player, it's got an auxiliary input on it. Uh, the radio does work. We've got it disconnected uh, just so it doesn't get left on and run the, radio, the battery down on the bike. But uh, it does work. Digital instrumentation. Uh, the Brute Force 750s are a 750cc V-twin engine. Uh, there's your two cylinders. So you got one cylinder going forward and one cylinder going back. These are fuel injected, liquid cooled, lots of power. If you've never ridden a Brute Force 750, these things just make phenomenal power. They run really, really strong. There's a, there's a little box inside here in the storage compartment that lets you change the the way those lights flash by pushing these buttons uh, you can change the way those lights flash uh, on there uh, but anyway it's kind of cool so nice if you're out at the off-road park riding at night you can turn the lights on and if you're riding with a group it lets them kind of separate you from everybody else uh, with those lights so pretty cool uh, these are an automatic transmission, uh, so you've got your shifter right here, and you've got low, high, neutral, reverse, just move your shifter through your gate. Uh, selectable two-wheel drive and four-wheel drive here, with a locking front differential. Here, this will lock your front differential. Headlights off, low, and high beam, there's your start button. Let's go ahead and turn the key on and take a look at the instrumentation. Um, try to get the glare. But you've got a fuel gauge, speedometer, tells you if you're in two wheel drive or four wheel drive. Uh, everything works on this four wheeler. You've got to roll a little bit to make them shift. Clock, uh, 379 miles, and then we'll push the mode button. Trip meter A, trip meter B, those are resettable. And then there's your hours, 128 hours of use on this bike. So relatively low hours. Uh, this little switch is for the lights that are on the top of the box, and then this controller in here controls those two other two LED lights there. It's a 12 volt power outlet. And uh, ignition switch is here. And then uh, just push the, there's no choke because of the fuel injection, so these start up real easy. Just push the button, cranks right up. Throttle. There. Anyway, no smoking, runs good. The Brute Force 750s have hydraulic disc brakes in the front, and then they use a multi-disc wet rear brake in the back, which means instead of the brake being out here at each one of the wheels, the brake is actually right in here, and it's on the drive shaft coming back, and uh, it just keeps that brake real clean, keeps it out of the mud and uh, the grit, and it makes those brakes last a long time. But right in there, is your multi-disc wet rear brake. Okay. But all in all, this bike is uh, 
is pretty clean. Let's see, what else is there to tell you about? So you got the radio, the lights, speakers, uh, the backrest, wheels and tires, lift kit. This bike's got several, uh, at least probably $2,000 in options on it. Uh, so it makes it a real good value, if, especially if you're looking for a bike to go to the off-road park and ride. This one's set up and ready to go. And uh, sure beats buying a new one and then spending a whole bunch of money on add-ons. But uh, good looking bike here. Alright, so there it is. 2008 model. Brute Force 750 with fuel injection. Uh, come by and take a look at this one. Uh, come by and take a ride on it. We are Mainland Cycle Center, and we're located about 30 minutes south of downtown Houston, just off of I-45 in Lamarck, Texas. Our website is MainlandCycleCenter.com. Our phone number is 409-948-4969. Give us a call, shoot us an email, come by and see us. We'd love to help any way we can. Hey, thanks for watching.